is in us. When you see so many people together, nobody's question, right? Um, that you are different, that you are from this place, from other place. They know that we are from Brazil, but when you get it together, we dance. No, have many things to do. Um, we needed to to look for uh, places for people to stay. No, uh, they travel. Um, we need to organize food places where the workshops happen. No, um, have a lot of things to to make to do to organize we needed to uh, to have a, a group no a team no we need to pay many things to to do for this imagine we're giving donations to the uh, missing and uh, murdered women and girls um, the indigenous tribes of North Carolina. So if you would like to make a donation, a contribution to them, please go on the website and make a generous contribution. Yes, um, I don't believe in calling on the names and, in, and spirits of indigenous people without helping their communities. It's useless if you don't do anything. So please make a contribution to them. Um, also so we're going to go from this side back to where the window is. That side of the room, we're going to put the Russians across the floor to the drums. So if everyone make your way back. Lavagem for Brazilian it means the significance of the lavagem is a way that being blessed and the waters to wash all the negativities uh, on the way to change to a better um, place and to change to peer ourselves and to peer our community, to peer our streets where we pass and by. And that's the main significance of the lavagem based in a tradition of Oxalá one of the oldest Orisha in the Pantheon of Canoblé, specifically in Brazil. Um, when we think about lavagem uh, in Brazil and the lavagem, the first lavagem happening here in Charlotte through the vision of Tamara, the, the beauty and the blessing of this is to uh, develop the idea of sense in the community of Charlotte. And that's what I see here. This event to bring, it, bring all these people together. Just that. It's already amazing. 